that's on display tonight is Egyptian art, um, which shows what happened in Egypt. It's a painting done with acrylic paint. Well, it's based on a book, The Giver. Um, it was a project we had to do. We had to pick our own book and remake the book cover. Well, I have a pastel of a, it was based on Georgia O'Keeffe's work. And so it's um, a hibiscus flower was the original image. And then I kind of distorted it my own way. Paintings, printmakings, drawings. You name it, and they've probably got it here tonight. Well, tonight we have our middle school art show. Uh, it's a time where all the students who participate in art throughout the year can showcase their work for their families, friends, and other teachers in the district. An event like this allows students to see what they've done throughout the year and how their art has progressed. They've progressed quite a bit. At the beginning of the year, they were so you know timid and afraid to express themselves through art, but as you know, you encourage and you challenge them, they really kind of step up to the plate and just grow so much over such a short period of time. It's really amazing to see. And the students' art continues to develop as they learn new techniques within the classroom. We're learning how to shade and like how to sketch out characters to like just make comics and be free in art. Right now, we're about to start doing color reels, which shows primary and secondary colors. Now, we um, just finished our wire sculpture, which was really cool to do, so we got to learn how to um, solder and to manipulate the wire. And my piece also came out kind of abstract, but um, that was really fun. I really enjoyed it. As you can tell, the class lessons have been paying off. It's gratifying for parents, teachers, and students to be able to admire different types of artwork from all over the district. I guess, because I think it brings a different aspect to it when you see it actually hung up and see it, other people looking at it. And I just think it's really cool. For About Town, this is Susan Kamyab reporting.